Hi everyone. Our first video on this notorious maths problem, 8 divided by 2 times 2 plus 2, that's gone viral on social media, has stirred up plenty of controversy. People are still coming up with different answers and explanations. So let's see if we can clear the air a bit. Some people have said that uh, where there's any doubt or ambiguity in a problem, you should work from left to right. But where's the mathematical basis for that idea? The simple fact is there isn't any. It doesn't make any sense. Others have talked about certain methods like uh, PEMDAS or BODMAS. But what matters isn't some method or other learned by rote, but real maths. In mathematics, a method is just a procedure to do something that follows from the definition of certain concepts and properties. It's these basic concepts and properties that matter, not rules that have been memorized and are sometimes applied mistakenly without a proper understanding. Also, some tricky arguments have been put forward. Uh, for example, that a division is nothing more than the inverse of a multiplication. Well, yes, that's how it is with a field. But then comes the trick. If that's the case, it's been argued, you can first express an operation as a product and then apply the associative property. Well, that doesn't work. Uh, if you express a division as the inverse of a product, you've already done the division. You just haven't written the result down. It's like if you were given a present that's been wrapped up, you've still been given the present. The problem involves integers, and in the set of integers z, only 1 and minus 1 have inverses. It makes no sense to write 2 to the minus 1. Also in z, which is a Euclidean domain, division generally involves a quotient and a remainder. Yes, if it's exact, you just get a quotient as a result. But you can't simply ignore the fact that division has this extra possibility, which the subtraction of whole numbers doesn't. And it doesn't matter if you express the division as a fraction. The trap is the same. You've already done the grouping. Some people see the parenthesis at the end and apply the distributive property to doing the product. But there's nothing to say that the multiplication has to be done first. Perhaps the controversy will continue. But in the end, there's only one final answer to this, and that is that the problem in its original form is ambiguous. Forget whatever rules you've learned. The mathematics is clear. Without an additional set of parentheses, there's no way of knowing whether the division or multiplication should be done first. Thanks for watching. Leave any comments you have below. Please subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll look forward to seeing you next time.